being a chosen one is both a humbling and empowering experience. When God sets you apart, it is not merely a gesture of favor but a call to a life of profound purpose. This divine purpose, which C.S. Lewis aptly calls, a rebellion that requires us to lay down our arms, is a unique path only you can walk. To answer God's call is to take on a mission that transcends personal ambition, one that requires sacrifice, courage, and unwavering faith. The chosen life demands resilience, and though it often involves trials and sacrifices, the blessings it brings are eternal, God does not call everyone to this path. He knows it requires a special kind of soul, one willing to forego comfort for the promise of a greater purpose. If you are on this journey, understand that there is a reason God chose you. While the world may not understand, there is peace in knowing that your sacrifices have purpose, that your isolation has a reason, and that the struggles you face are not in vain. The chosen life is a journey of becoming more like Christ and reflecting His love to a world in need of hope, being chosen by God is a gift, but it is a gift wrapped in sacrifice. You may have to let go of relationships, ambitions, or even dreams that no longer align with your divine calling. Imagine Abraham, who was called to leave his homeland and journey into the unknown, with only God's promise to guide him. This journey can be isolating. Not everyone will understand why you walk this path. The loss of familiar connections or worldly desires can feel like an immense cost, yet it is the very thing that allows you to be molded for your unique purpose. C.S. Lewis reminds us that being chosen often requires a transformation that the world cannot comprehend. It means letting go of habits, perspectives, and attachments that may have once defined you. The cost is steep, yet God promises that everything you surrender for His sake will be returned to you in ways beyond your imagining. While some see only sacrifice, the chosen see the opportunity to grow closer to God and to experience His boundless love in a deeper, more profound way. Isolation is one of the most profound and often painful challenges of being among the chosen. It's a path marked by an unseen seal, a divine calling that places you in a realm where few can relate, and fewer still can truly understand. This sense of separation can make it feel as though you're navigating an entirely different world, bearing burdens that go unseen, unknown, and often unappreciated by those around you. But in the quiet corners of this solitude, something miraculous begins to unfold, a sacred drawing near to God. It's in these moments that the chosen are not left empty but filled with His presence, a comfort that transcends anything the world could offer, this solitude is not simply loneliness. It is a purposeful quiet where God's hand gently shapes and refines you, like a potter working clay. The chosen are invited to become vessels through which His love and grace can flow, but only after the refining fires of isolation have done their work. Here, God peels back the layers of dependency on worldly things, revealing a deeper reliance on Him. Every tear cried in solitude, every whispered prayer in the stillness, is seen and heard by a loving Creator. In this quiet space, you are not abandoned but lovingly held, taught to lean into His promises, His love, and His power, which brings strength when the world feels distant, isolation, then, is transformed from a sorrowful burden into a sacred gift. It becomes a sanctuary where the chosen uncover resilience and wisdom that only God can reveal. In time, this solitary path leads to a more profound relationship with God, an intimacy that can withstand the trials of life. The chosen find in themselves a strength, born not of the world's comforts but of divine assurance, shining brighter and deeper than any earthly source could provide, the chosen path is not without signs. You may notice moments of divine alignment, coincidences that feel too significant to be chance. These signs are God's way of guiding you, whispering to you that you are not alone on this journey. Perhaps you find yourself drawn to certain scriptures, or you hear a message that speaks directly to your heart in a way that only God could orchestrate. These signs are reminders of God's presence and a reassurance that you are on the right path. They help you to stay the course even when the road becomes difficult. 
C.S. Lewis describes these signs as evidence of a divine calling that transcends logic and defies the ordinary. They are messages from God, urging you forward, giving you strength when you feel weak, and filling your heart with peace when you are tempted to doubt. As you embrace your calling, you will begin to see gifts within yourself that you may not have noticed before. God equips the chosen with talents and abilities tailored for their mission. These gifts are not for personal gain but for a higher purpose, to serve, to heal, and to guide others toward the light. You may discover that you have a natural ability to offer comfort, to teach, or to inspire others in ways that bring hope and joy to their lives, these gifts are divine tools, planted in your soul by God, waiting for the moment when you would be ready to use them. When you answer His call, these gifts will flourish, becoming a source of strength not only for yourself but also for those around you. They will shine brightest when you walk in obedience to God, serving as a testament to His love and His purpose for your life. The journey of being chosen is undeniably marked by trials, testing the heart, mind, and spirit in ways that can feel overwhelming. Moments of doubt, fear, and despair often arise, as if shadows loom over the path you're called to walk. Rejection may sting, and misunderstandings may leave you feeling alienated, but these are not random hardships, they are divine tools, carefully woven into your life to build you, not break you. Each trial, though painful, serves a profound purpose, allowing God to shape you into a vessel of strength, resilience, and unshakable faith. C.S. Lewis saw trials not as arbitrary obstacles, but as intentional, transformative lessons. He believed these hardships are designed by God to prepare the chosen for their ultimate calling. Just as raw gold must be placed in fire to achieve purity. The chosen are refined through the flames of adversity, emerging stronger and more reflective of God's love and grace. These trials teach reliance not on human strength or worldly approval, but solely on the unchanging, steadfast love of God. Each struggle pushes you closer to Him, a journey into trust and surrender, where His strength becomes evident in your weakness. Through these refining challenges, a beautiful transformation unfolds. You come to understand the depth of God's love, feeling His grace sustain you when the world feels too heavy to bear. You learn to walk in faith, becoming a living testament to God's power and a beacon of hope in a world thirsting for meaning. The journey of the chosen is not easy. But it is purposeful. In embracing each trial, you become a reflection of Christ, carrying His light, compassion, and strength, showing others that, even in the darkest times, hope endures, the rewards of being chosen extend beyond this world. C.S. Lewis reminds us that the true rewards are not always visible in the present. While the world may offer temporary comfort, God's blessings are eternal. The peace, joy, and fulfillment that come from following His will are greater than anything the world can offer. You will find that as you walk this path, you experience a level of peace and satisfaction that cannot be shaken by external circumstances. God promises that every sacrifice you make for His sake will be returned to you in ways that surpass human understanding. This is the eternal reward that awaits the chosen a life rich in love, purpose, and divine connection. Though the road may be challenging, the chosen life brings a depth of joy and peace that no worldly success can replicate. It is a life that reflects God's glory and brings light to those in darkness, fulfilling the divine mission for which you were created. As a chosen one, you are set apart to be a light in the darkness, a symbol of hope and faith for those around you. The journey you walk, filled with trials and triumphs alike, becomes a living testament to God's unwavering love and limitless power. Though challenges may come, they serve not to diminish you but to reveal the strength of God within you. In moments of weakness, His power shines through, demonstrating that His grace is sufficient, that His love overcomes all adversity, and that His presence can transform even the most difficult circumstances, you carry within you the profound ability to inspire to bring healing, and to lead others toward a truth they may not yet see. God has uniquely equipped you, not just for yourself but for the sake of others, to be a source of encouragement and resilience. 
In embracing your calling, you become a vessel through which His love flows, touching hearts and lifting spirits. Your journey, marked by faith and determination, offers hope to those who feel lost, assuring them that even in the depths of struggle, God is near and His light shines brightest in the darkest hours. Each chapter of your story, though imperfect, becomes a powerful narrative of God's reality, His goodness, and His faithfulness. As you embrace the role of being a beacon, you illuminate the path for others, showing that God's promises hold firm and that His presence brings peace. Your life, in its authenticity and perseverance, becomes a living testimony, one that declares that God is not only real, but that He is good, faithful, and ever-present, even amid our deepest challenges. Through you, others see a glimpse of His love, and are reminded that hope is never out of reach, to be chosen is to live a life that reflects God's glory, a life that touches others in ways that only He can orchestrate. The road is not easy, but the rewards are eternal. As you walk this path, remember that you are not alone. God is with you, guiding every step, filling you with His strength, and surrounding you with His love. You are chosen for a purpose that goes beyond this world, a purpose that will leave a legacy of faith, hope, and love. In the words of C.S. Lewis, the chosen life is a journey of laying down our arms and surrendering to God's will. It is a path of sacrifice, transformation, and divine fulfillment. And though the world may not understand, there is peace in knowing that you are walking the road that God has prepared for you. May you embrace this calling with courage, faith, and joy. Knowing that the cost is far outweighed by the spiritual riches it brings.